In today's Canvify tutorial, you're going to learn how to create great looking Shopify pages leveraging the Canvify app, which is basically going to allow you to create good looking pages within Canva and then automatically import these pages onto your Shopify dashboard. So to get started, actually just head over to your Shopify dashboard and then look for Canvify right here on top and then click on search for Canvify in the Shopify app store. Now, I will also leave you the link for this down below but either way just select the Canvify app right here and then click on install which is just automatically going to install the app onto your dashboard. Now this is super straightforward just click on install right here and then you're going to be redirected to the Canvify app. Now, one thing which I really like is that right out of the box, you're going to get tons of different templates, which you can use for an easy setup. Now, some of these templates are only going to be available for the premium plan. However, Canvify actually also does offer quite a lot of great looking free templates, like for example, this service style one. And basically you can just preview each of these templates. You can see if you like them and you can then actually choose a template that you want to use. Now, as for this video, I guess I will just go with this shop appeal template right here. And to actually now customize and use this template, you will just have to click on use in Canva, which is automatically going to open up the Canva editor. And right here, just click on use template for new design. And then you are going to be redirected to the editor right here. Now, probably you are already familiar with the Canva editor. This is super straightforward. On the left, you do have your different kind of elements elements that you can add, but generally what I would recommend you to do is just go over this website right here and then just change the things that you want to customize. Like for example, let's say that we are going to uh, create a clothing company. So I'm then just going to say something like great clothing at a cheap price. Now I'm just making things up right now, but basically you will just have to customize this. You will have to change the pictures right here. Now, if you do want to, for example, make this button right here clickable, you would just have to uh, right click this and then click on link right here. And then you can add a link onto this. So just for simplicity stakes, I will just go with Google right here, just to show you that this is possible. However, obviously you can right here also put in your collections page, your product page and so on. Basically it doesn't really matter what you're going to put in right here, it is going to work either way. And then once you are ready and once you've actually customized your Canva page, you will just have to click on publish a website right here on the top. Now, this is really important. Just click on free domain right here. It doesn't really matter. And then select advanced settings right here and deselect search engine visibility because otherwise this page will actually be indexed on Google, which typically we don't want as we rather want to actually index the Shopify page on its own. And then click on publish. Now Canva is going to prepare your design. And once this is done, you will just have to copy this right here and head over to the Canvify app. Now click on close and now select pages and then select import new page right here. Now this is going to open up the pages editor right here. Just paste in your Canva link and then put in the title. Now as for this video, I will just go with home page main and then click on import page right here. If we now import this, this will actually right away show up on our pages section right here. So click on online store, click on pages, and now we can see the home page main section. As you can see, if we're now going to click on view page right here, this is going to redirect us to the page that we have just made with Canva, with all of the different animations, buttons, pictures, and so on. And this button right here uh, actually will just redirect us to Google as we have set up earlier. Now, one thing which I want to highlight is that if at some point you actually do want to update this, you will just have to go back to the Canva editor and then you can change the things that you want to change. So let's for example, just uh, delete this text right, er, text right here, then click on publish site. Now this is going to be updated. So just click on continue. And once you've updated it on Canva, you will just have to go back to your Canvify app and then just click on this update button right here, which is then going to automatically update that page within seconds. Now you don't necessarily have to rely on these templates right here. You can rather actually just go through the hassle of creating your own Canva site from scratch. So if you want to do that, you will have that option. You will just have to edit everything to your likings and you will then have to click on this button right here and then go through the same process as we've made earlier. So now we are basically done with setting up our pages. 
However, let me now actually show you how to display these pages on your Shopify store. Because as of right now, these pages aren't actually visible. And let me show you how to change this. So just head over to online store right here. And now let's for example say that we want to add this home page onto our store. To do that, just click on customize right here. And now we will have to add a new section right here on the left called pages right here, page. And then we will have to select the page. So in our case, we will just have to click on select page right here and select home page main. Then this is selected, click on select. And then you will actually have to delete all of the other content on your website. So just remove this right here, remove this right here, as well as this one and this space right here. I will also delete the announcement bar right here. And once we have saved this, we can now actually preview our page. So head back to your dashboard, click on view online store. This will redirect us to the page that we have made using Canvify. Now, obviously you could also go ahead and add other pages onto your store using the navigation bar right here. And you can then just redirect the person to a special sale, a special offer and so on. But as of right now, I will actually leave you the link to Canify in the comments down below. And if you do have any questions, make sure to also leave them in the comments down below. And I will try to get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you for watching.